Coming up in today's vlog. Let's take some shots. Come on, let's take some shots. Let's do it. Okay. Come on. What do you want to drink? period y'all already know for those that's new to my channel welcome and those returning hey gang lachey gang period the best gang coming up on youtube but yeah you guys i'm just gonna start the video now instead of talking too much right now i'm about to get ready and um we're about to go to the nail shop because i'm about to get my nails done and then i'll probably get my eyebrows touched up as well i'm doing a new color today i'm doing lavender um i want to do a new shape as well i always get coughing like i literally stand by coughing all the way but i think i'm gonna end up doing either stiletto or maybe square square has been speaking to me so i'll probably end up getting square i really want to do black nails y'all don't know how bad i've been wanting to do black nails i would have did black nails right but like under them you know like the red bottom nails that'd be so cute but i don't know i'll probably end up doing it like my next set or something who knows but yeah guys um i'm about to go ahead and get ready because we need to move around it's already um what i say it's already like um mm, probably 12 i don't know i think it is 12 i don't know my phone's in there but that's besides the point let me go ahead and get dressed and i'll be right back guys okay you guys i'm about to be vlogging today but i just wanted to show y'all my fit real quick Ignore the background, I know it's messy. We just been doing a lot of um cleaning and stuff, but whatever. This is the fit for today. And yeah, guys, we're about to go to the nail shop so I can get my nails done. And I told you guys I'm doing the lavender colors. I'll get back to you when we get in the car or when we get to the nail shop. I don't know which one. But make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll talk to y'all later. my lashes i did it myself since we putting y'all on i don't know if some y'all some y'all probably had this already y'all it won't focus on the drink hold on there you go yeah go get that that looks so clear um oh huh i was talking about the flavor waters um they taste like actual juice but it's water it just got like additives probably oh let me show y'all this you is the hair what it look like when it's wet it's not as wet as it was it's already started drying because it's hot in houston but that's really besides the point as of right now like any major youtubers i want to collab with um i definitely want to collab with lily because it's my favorite youtuber and i feel like her whole vibe, like her aesthetic on her channel, is so raw. Okay, I'm gonna hold my camera because, yeah. But, um, I just really wanna collab with, um, who else other than Leah Lee? Probably Tiara Walker, because I want her to teach me about makeup like how to do it fast and stuff like that um Aaliyah J she seemed cool I wanna collab with her what, what about Kiana? Kiana J? yeah yeah Kiana I wanna link with Kiana too cause Kiana lit and I don't know she don't really stay in too much shit I mean you know even though she was just in some shit but that was different you know that was just like some other shit but anyways yeah i'm gonna like wait uh kiana um oh y'all look so cute big big busting out the billy ben tango oh. ah ah bah, bah, bah. this is how uh tiktokers be they be like oh i think i did it i think that was so wrong oh my god Y'all, when I learn how to do TikTok, it's over with. But I'm actually, yeah. Y'all go add me on TikTok because I'm about to start doing TikToks probably today. Um, I'm not really sure which TikToks I'm going to do, but I'm going to try to do as many as possible. I definitely want to do the Young Miami ones. They be funny as fuck, but I got to watch this shit like 12 times. It's like one of them that I know how to do for real, and it describes me. 
if y'all see me keep looking outside all nervous like it's because we had a gas station and the bees like to come into the car door and my girlfriend likes to keep her car door open while she's pumping gas i was talking about me looking for the bees because you like leaving the door open when you pump gas oh uh huh and they like your scent they like coming in here because i be drowning myself in perfume like if i don't spray myself 16 times front oh, and back uh, it's not enough you don't smell her before she even when she pulled in the parking lot that's what i'm saying you gotta smell me from a mile away no she means business period period because I, if you think of yourself as a business hey, if you're a kid you right now always, watching this <laughs> If you think of yourself as a business and you always keep yourself up, you always keep your, you know, maintenance up and stuff like that, people will respect you more. You know, like a lot of people's judgment come off your looks. Don't think it's all your brains in it. No, people are lying who say that. Everything is about your looks. Even when it comes to jobs, college interviews, relationships, friendships, people want to only be around people who keep themselves up. So remember that. So make sure you always smell good. Make sure you always brush your teeth and your breath smell good. Make sure your clothes are always looking nice and fitting right and stuff like that. Because anything too small, you know, everybody's like, oh, you're gay. Or, oh, you're trying to be a hoe. And then if anything's too big and baggy, oh, you're homeless. Or you're broke. Or you don't have money. Stupid shit. Like, you got to wear a designer and all that. You do not need none of that shit. Do not let nobody tell you that. All you got to do is make sure you keep yourself up, make sure you look nice. As long as you happy and you feel pretty or you feel cute or you feel handsome, whatever, it's all that matters. Everybody opinions do not matter unless they're going to pay for you to get a whole new wardrobe, new shoes, new hair, whatever they hate on. You need to make sure, like, that you feel good. That's all that matters at the end of the day. Make sure you live your life how you want to live it because you only get one. Y'all, I really been struggling to open this car mix so y'all finna sit right here for a second but um my girlfriend keep looking at the camera because she think i'm showing something my purse is blocking everything i didn't say you were showing nothing like, i was looking at the camera to see what they see that's what i'm saying they no i'm saying like what they see like what can they see on the camera like can they see you opening everything like what all is in the camera i'm not wearing my but you're in love me though Shut the fuck up. Yeah. Well, you can't put that in there because I just can't. But, you know. Girl, I was keeping it. Sh shut the front door. Why y'all always say shut the front door? What about the back door? Y'all just gonna leave it wide open? People usually, statistically, people go through back doors before front doors. Shut up. Yeah, I was that kid. <laughs> I used to be getting on people's ass. Y'all used to have a nail tech, but she started acting shysty when she started getting the love. One eternity later. All right, you guys. Um, right now I'm just in the car waiting on my girlfriend. She just went to the store to. She just went to go handle something, and um. Yeah, so I just wanted to chill with you guys and talk to you a little bit. I probably end up doing like a series of play, like Bob songs. <laughs> Shorty says she like, like, ready cause she freaky Make some plans with my <laughs> Alright you guys, we just made it to the nail salon Um, I'm trying to hurry up and talk to you guys before I have to put my mask on Cause I got Carmex on, I hit with my Carmex Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa it was a big what? Oh my God. Yeah, we gotta go. <laughs> Y'all, we gotta go to another nail shop because that one was too full. Definitely not going to see this though, but we do need to hurry up and get in the car because we don't know where that was point. And then they only got two people. That's what I'm saying. Y'all, I don't know why she even still sitting here trying to go into this nail shop. It's already too full. I don't want to be in a full nail shop. She said, oh, they done right now. So she can take my nails right now? Yeah. So what about them other people who's sitting there? I guess they was just with somebody else. Oh. I guess because everybody else is going to be. Well, let's try this again. Hopefully without the wasp attack. 
They is terrified of them. I'm terrified of anything that can sting me because I don't know what I'm allergic to. Look at that ugly ass shit. <laughs> but yeah, you guys, I'm about to walk in as you can see. Um, nails. Nail? Full set acrylic. Uh, how many? Just one. Just you. Give me a rock. 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 Shape now, so and I got the brows done too. Look at the brows, like come through, period. And then you see the nails, like look at them, yes, like period. <laughs> Y'all love these nails. I think this is the cutest shit ever. But right now we're on the way to Olive Garden because we're gonna go on a date. So y'all about to see what we end up getting what we end up talking about at the table i will talk to you guys when we get there and um yeah make sure you like comment and subscribe i hope you enjoyed this video and i'll be back hi you guys we just arrived at olive garden i know you can't see me just yet cause... all right um my camera all wobbly i think i got a tightness hold on there we go it's a little tighter but look where we're at. Hello, Gordon. Excuse me, thank you. Yes. Ma'am? Yes. Thank you. Alright you guys, I'm about to um order. I already know what I'm getting. I don't never look at this menu and try nothing new. But today I am going to get a drink from here because I'm finally legal. But I don't know what I'm going to get. I'll probably get this peach bellini right here. I'll probably get that. But I don't know. I'm trying to get some wine. But I don't know which one is like fruity, you know? This white wine, this bread wine. Oh, we can, yeah. Hold on, guys. I'm about to sit y'all up. Uh, tea and then a blackberry pineapple as well. What do you think? Maybe you need a sprite and a pickle cup. Sprite and a pickle cup, okay. What do you mean? What kind of dish? Um. Well, I'm getting pasta today, and okay. I really want wine, but I don't know which one to do. Do you have a preference? You want sweeter? You want yeah, sweeter. Sweeter? Okay. Well, um, usually, like, so from the top all the way to the bottom, it's going to be, like, sweetest to driest. Okay. So, um, a lot of people like to do, like, the Moscato del Primo more. That one's usually really good with any type of pasta. Um, if you want to do, like, the Roscato, a lot of people like that one as well. And then some of those are also going to be $15 a bottle as well. I don't know if you want to do a whole bottle. Or just no, a I just want a glass. Just a glass? Okay. Did you want to, what do you think? Um... Can I try the pink Moscato blend? The pink Moscato, you want to sample it? Yeah. Absolutely. We can place our order too? Uh, let me wait on Anthony. He's going to be with you in just a second. He'll get you order and everything, okay? Oh, okay. Yeah, absolutely. Y'all, I'm so happy. We're on a date. How you feeling? Chilling. I mean, I ain't start off so 
because I got us waiting. Moscato blend. Yeah. Um, you want to go first or you want me to go first? Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, I just want the chicken alfredo. Well, the seafood alfredo, I guess. The seafood, the seafood alfredo, it got scallops in it. I don't want scallops. So just get the chicken alfredo and add shrimp or get the yeah. shrimp alfredo and add chicken. Yeah, so can I get the chicken alfredo and just add shrimp? Two of those. Two? Mm -hmm. And would you like soup or salad? Salad, please. For both? Mm-hmm. I'll go get on that for you. Okay. Do you like a water? Um, can I also get a Sprite as well? Okay. Thank you. Do you like that to-go to go cup too? Yes. This is my vlog now. Hello, if you have not noticed, and all the vlogs I do have on tummy, but that's because I like tummy. I let them know, every tummy is different. Every tummy is different, yeah. Some of, I ain't even, I ain't even know. I ain't even know. Yo, I'm gonna get this for That's what I'm saying. I'm ready for my salad. y'all probably confused like why did you start celebrating your birthday after your birthday is already gone like i said i've been waiting i was waiting for my hair to get in and for my hair to come in and all of this stuff before i went out so that's i'm celebrating my birthday i guess it's somebody else's birthday too because they clapping and stuff well i said too my birthday not today to me happy birthday to me
One eternity later. Win. Do you have um plastic silver? Oh yes, we do. Can we get two? Yes, I do.
you guys. We just got done eating. We're leaving now. Um, we had a really good meal. We Wait, still got leftovers. Look at this big truck, y'all. Can y'all see? Hey, everything bigger than Texas. Yeah. All right, you guys. So um, we're currently on the way to um, Grand Prix. Yeah, we're going to Grand Prix to, or I think it's Grand Prix. Are we vlogging today? Yeah. yeah. These guys start at like $25 for the single hoses. Uh, some of them are 30. You can get a double hose for uh, 35. And then uh, we have the bigger double hoses for 50. Uh, these guys yeah. are all around uh, $100 or less. And then up there we have the premium selection, 200 and up. So my recommendation is if you're starting with like you want a starter hookah, I would recommend maybe one of the pumpkins. Um, yeah, those hit like real well. This one's very nice. This one's 60 bucks, and it's a whole metal one. You'll get it real smooth, and it'll last a lot longer than one of the minis. Mm. Mm. How much is that? The black one up there? The black and yeah. one? This one? Yeah. I believe it's 25 Let me mm -hmm. check, though, and make sure. Hey, what's up, boss? How you doing? What's up, baby? You all right? This one's... 35 looks like. Oh no, that's two hoses. Sorry. That's a black one with two hoses? Uh, this one doesn't come with two hoses, but I do have some. This one's $27.99. No, I was asking, is that a black one? The one you just had? Yes. The 30 that's one. The box, yeah. I have double hose black ones. Um, Can I see a double hose black Let one? Let me grab it for you. It's in the back. Alright. Is it that size too? Uh huh. Okay. They're all this size. Okay. So. There is the clear stem and the base. Just be careful with this. And it's a white frosted glass on the bottom. So it's real nice. Comes with the white bowl as well, so it's gonna fit right there. Two hoses. So this is gonna be the black single hose hookah. And it comes with the that's the hose, here's the bowl included, and then here is the base. Yeah, it is really pretty. It's called the pumpkin design. Yeah, this is cute, mm -hmm. and it matched the design so of the hose. Like uh -huh. Yeah, you put the hose right there, tobacco up here, foil, coals, and you're good to go orange flavor a lot of people like bubble gum or strawberry um, and then mint is nice to mix in with any flavor that you're smoking just to get a cooler hit yeah everybody was telling me to do meat yeah you just want to mix a little bit of myth with whatever fruity flavor you do get uh -huh. and then we also have flavors mixed with mint so we have lemon mint grape mint cherry mint grapefruit mint two apple mint two apple mint tastes kind of like licorice if y'all like that we have chocolate with mint okay you guys so today we're with the owner of um the hampshire store and i was just wondering um could you tell me a little bit about like your business and specifically your delta eight because we talked to a um associate before and she told us that you guys like really grow all your own delta eight products mm -hmm. so uh a lot of our delta eight flowers are uh grown from our farm in Oregon mm -hmm. and uh, they've been infused with Delta 8 locally in Houston and they are all manufactured here. Uh, our brand is called Empire CBD Wellness Center and this is our Empire Smoke Shop. Uh, it's our second location and a uh, whole bunch of awesome Delta 8 products. Everything is federally compliant. Um, it is uh, illegal in Texas and it does have a high so it's a really good product. Um, I would highly recommend stopping by. All of our prices are 10 to 20% lower than online prices. And honestly, when y'all get bulk, I hook people up just like I did for you. Mm -hmm. um, any repeating customers, I like to take care of y'all. Any products you need, we can order it and have it here in three days. So all of our pricing on water pipes, on vapes are incredible. Disposable nicotine vaporizers, we have about 20,000 of them. Okay. So 200 different flavors, huge variety, awesome selection. Please stop by. 
And do you guys grow your um, Delta yeah. 8? Y'all grow that in Texas? Yeah, or? so uh, basically uh, it's grown in Oregon. Okay. Our farm's in Oregon. And um, it's grown uh, organically from the hemp farm. Uh, a couple new strains we have down here are the... Um, this one is going to be our Delta 8 Lemon Haze strain. And then this one is going to be our regular CBD special sauce. But this one's from my newest harvest from my farm. So it's very fresh flowers, uh, really high quality nugs. Um, this one's testing at about 19% and it's very soft because it's so fresh it breaks apart really easily. Uh, if you touch it, it's like very, very soft because they harvested this like literally not even two weeks ago. What would you tell someone that's trying to get into like the, um, how do I say this, like the weed business and weed like business. Delta 8 and weed. stuff like that? Yeah, definitely. So this past weekend I was in Las Vegas at the Tobacco Plus uh, Expo. Mm -hmm. I got back last night, so back to work. But go to a convention, you'll learn so much about it. Uh, one of my really good friends grows cannabis in Oklahoma legally and he has a whole uh, business over there, indoor grow facility, and it is very lucrative. If you do do it the right way, there's a lot of money to be made. Uh, I invest in a lot of cannabis stocks on uh, you know, the stock market as well. So there's a lot of room to invest in cannabis, whether it's on a, you know, in another company or on your own scale. And uh, there's already a, a bill to pass legalization of growing hemp in, East, in Texas. So I've already applied for that and I have land that I applied to grow on. So whenever that gets passed, we're actually gonna start growing in Texas rather than Oregon. So that would be great because then we can even speed up our manufacturing. Um, one uh, piece of advice that's super critical for anybody who's looking into getting into the industry, mm -hmm. make sure you grow high quality stuff and lab tested. Third-party lab tests are very critical because they ensure complete transparency. Every single one of our products, whether it's in the showcase, anything back here has a QR code. Right here, right here, all of our products have that QR code. On there you can see how much CBD is in it, how much THC is in it, which terpene profile it is, exactly which farm uh, or which part of the U.S. the hemp came from. So it's really good to have that because that way we ensure complete transparency to our customers. Okay. Nothing synthetic, no additives, everything's all natural, organic, none of the stuff has any side effects, nobody has ever died from weed, so definitely some good stuff. It really helps with a lot of different things, anxiety, stress, uh, the FDA actually approved CBD for Alzheimer's and epilepsy. That means it's approved to reduce seizures and things like that, so... It really helps people and I love my job because I help people get off of opioids and people taking these hard medications to get on all natural solutions. My hemp capsules are a great replacement for high pain relievers. So that's what I always recommend. Okay. Very nice yeah. talking to you and come check out Empire Smoke Shop located in Humble right across from IH Airport. All right, y'all, I know it's trash right there, but this is the house that's lived in, so of course it's gonna be trash in the house. And we got valet trash, and they came and got a chick. It don't come until eight. It's only like five, so mind your business. But anyways, so here's the hookah, and all the stuff to come with. All right, so it's Oh, okay. Well, I'm not gonna pour this out, then. Yeah, yeah, just the flavor of the new one. Mm -hmm. right. And then they use the codes, whatever. These the little things to, you know. The codes and the juice to the tobacco. Yeah. Ice, get down your ice. What? And you put it in there, it makes the, the smokes like the pool more smooth. Oh, how am I supposed to put the water? Is it right here? Uh -huh. So, why is it not it? Oh. These are supposed to probably do to take or anything. It's starting to work. Uh oh. Y'all see how I never had it look good because I clearly didn't know what was going on. 
You want me to some ice? Cause I don't think. Yeah, you can use like ice and water. Like you know, the ice water mixture. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Oh you yeah. I'm gonna sit down, y'all, cause I look like I'm super tall. But look. Um, We got a lavender candle and it matched my nails. Super vibey. Okay. It, it smells pretty good. These are our other hookahs. And this is how to set it up. The instructions right here. We have to go get some foil. Yeah, guys, my fault. We have to go get some foil. I was just thinking about like this setup. I like how this is set up. I might put the ring light facing this way. Well, we'll be right back. We have to. I already just said that, y'all. I'm really zooted from that little pin. <laughs> Alright you guys, we're back. We went and got the foil. We just gonna put the sweetener stuff on there. We mix in cherry and mint together. Oh, that was you? Mm -hmm. I don't know what I'm trying to do. Look you guys, we got it all set up. This is the hookah. Oh, hold on, let me... Oh, if y'all like it, I'm gonna come back when it's finally able to like actually blow smoke. Hey y'all. So I was able to get my camera together because it was having a little te uh, technical difficulties. Louis, sit down. But, I was able to get it all set up. But, um, this is like a little torch. Y'all see? Dude, these chairs don't wiggle, they just chill out. Louie, lay down! This nigga clingy, y'all, oh, bro. Yeah, this thing just needs to be up under us 24 saving. Y'all probably can't even hear us because that ain't microwave at home. You gonna turn on? Yeah. You gotta stop doing it. I am. That's what I'm doing. But you guys, this is the cool guy. It's just a simple black logo. Yes, ma'am. Y'all gonna get better. Really, it's this, but. You gotta pull the full on person. Y'all see it's darker? Lay down. This is not somebody with baby moves, but kissy. I just wanted to come talk to y'all because I know I never did one of these little sit down videos and really just talk to y'all. But I hope y'all, you know, enjoying all of these videos, all this content I'm about to put out because. Well, the content I'm going, I'm putting out because obviously this is all going to get edited and uploaded. So, yeah, I hope y'all enjoy everything. Um, Baby, five dollars to grab one of these. I'm not about to let you do that move. Uh, y'all see what kind of stuff she do? Y'all want to hit it? Right? Y'all want to puff, puff, pass, repass? No, I'm just kidding. I would have passed it to y'all if it wasn't COVID going on. You hear me? If it wasn't a COVID, I would have passed you the COVID. Y'all think we should take some shots? Oh, yeah, girl. Let's take some shots. Come on, let's take some shots. Let's get it. Okay. Come on. What do you want to drink? Anyways. 
Anyways, hello. I guess we can't take shots because she's about to go to a party. Yeah, I can't let Louie try to sniff nothing because his sniffing turned into licking. His licking is not the greatest thing. The nigga's bad. Y'all want to see him? Come on here, Louie. Come on. Can y'all see him? I got y'all. Oh, this was in the way. Louis, Girl, come, come here. There you go. Y'all see him looking for something to do. He bad. Oh, I'm sorry, Missy. Um, the shrimp just came, man. Y'all see the vibes. I'm gonna probably take a picture of it Cartoon with my uh, flash on. Hey, she over there. Don't worry about what I was stuttering about. Look at her, cute. Oh, yeah. Y'all, I just got a hoopie. I'm gonna show y'all when I set it up and stuff when we get home. <coughs> Y'all, I'm gonna show y'all when I set it up and stuff when we get home. And then I got LEDs. We've been having LEDs in our living room since we moved in. So it's gonna be a whole vibe in there. I think that video, I'll probably make that like a story time. Or maybe I just might chat with y'all or something. I don't really know. If y'all hear friction mm. in the bag, this is my girlfriend's eating. But I'm about to put y'all over here mm -hmm. so y'all can see, watch us eat. Wait. Y'all let us know if y'all wanna um, update it, apartment tour, because things have changed. A lot. Yo, look. Oh, what? I don't know why this girl on that Y'all, I ain't eat these with uh, pecante sauce, so I don't know what this supposed to taste like, but I'm gonna eat it. That's good. Y'all be getting um, mug bangs in the vlogs because every time we go out, I record for y'all.
We just got to the bathroom and um, we're about to wash our hands and stuff. I didn't even notice to do my eyelashes. But um, I think I'm gonna take some pictures because I like the vibe behind me. They ain't never been on so. Yeah, they never do. But yeah, guys, um, I'm about to take some pictures and stuff and then you guys will be able to see them later so I'm gonna post them on my Instagram. Um, yeah. That's really pretty much it for right now. I'm really the goat. It's for you. Oh, it, it was two napkins. One went in, one went out. So, that's one. Yeah. Why are you on the toilet? Why are you in my business? Woman? Hey, we finna steal this and put it in the living room. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I want the flowers. Taking over the vlog from the school. <laughs> they thought we ran out this junk. You ready to go? Yeah. Oh, you ready to go? What's that? He thought we was gonna walk out. <laughs> she just going <kept> black. <laughs> he thought we saw. He thought we was gonna walk and ditch on their yeah, ass. Let me go grab you a couple of ice. We shot it, come on. Mumpy. you guys so right now um we're actually about to go to jack in the box and um go get something to eat oh i didn't even do my intro hey y'all it's your girl mario lachey if you're new to my channel welcome if you're coming back welcome back to lachey gang you know what i'm saying and if you're new go ahead and hit that subscribe button make sure you like this video because yeah you need to join lachey gang because we went up but anyways um i really am excited and hyper right now and also this tripod keeps wobbling so if the camera is just you know whatever but you guys, we just did a prank with King, um, the real King Kaiser. Yeah, we just did a really lit prank with him, and we're about to start editing and stuff like that. You know, y'all think I'm playing, like, I'm really about to start editing. But we gotta go get some food, so we're gonna go ahead and do that. Um, I don't know what we're gonna get. Well, yes, I do. I don't even know. I just lie like that. We're getting Jack in the Box. Um, I come back to the house and start editing. And I just wanted y'all to come on a ride, you know, like a little car vlog, you know, a quick little vlog or whatever, a mini vlog. Yeah, it's gonna be a mini vlog with Mari Lachey. So I'm gonna come right back though, you guys. 
Y'all, we in the car right now. Bay driving kind of crazy if I get whiplash on camera. <laughs> but um, we just arrived. We just arrived at the stove to Jack in the Box. But um, I just wanted to come on here and like really talk to y'all about you know oh, us meeting. Can I have two ten-piece nuggets? Oh, you said two Japanese nuggets? Yeah, and um, two breakfast jacks. Okay. And a hash brown. Alright, anything else That is weird. Alright, give it to me. Okay. That was pretty quick. Yes, sir, yes, sir. Oh. And remember, if you, not this one, but this one in the back right here, if yeah. you twist it, it do the lights. Yeah, that was pretty quick. But let me tell you about getting this this uh collab together. Let me let me just tell you about it. So right, we wake up, we um you know finish cleaning whatever we need to clean, like straightening up or whatever because you know whatever. And um so we so busy focused on trying to make a good impression, we started running behind or whatever. So we finally get to the house and you know get done with everything. And so it was hard to try to get Bay to leave on Tom because of the fact that I was trying to make sure, like, you know, nothing went wrong with the video. But, um, you got me two to piece niggas, right? Yeah. Okay. Breakfast looks like a dog. I thought it was going to be more than that. That's why I asked. But... Yeah, guys, like trying to get her out so I can get him in to do the prank or whatever. That was so hard, like it was crazy. And then can we so, get um, when he got there, we we're going to the house and stuff like that, sauce and, and um, barbecue sauce and great deal. Like it was crazy because no, let me even go back further than that. So I'm getting ready and stuff. Like I noticed that my closure was like lifting a little bit, so I like had to lay it back down and put my um hair scarf back on that's why i have my hair scarf in the video because i had just laid it down and when i tried to take it off it was like it's still tacky right now like look it's still tacky so when i tried to take my scarf off it was like a little too wet to where it wouldn't even come off and i didn't want to pull it off and it got like the little white stuff so yeah and if that's what like if y'all can see that a little bit because i think it's something like right here that's because i had to relay down my closure and then i had used this little i'll show y'all the spray when i get home but it's like a little red bottle that's supposed to be like got to be but it's like less harsh and like you don't need like a blow dryer to dry it because when i put it on it really just like dried up by itself unless i put too much you know but so i had that problem so i just kept it on or whatever i wasn't tweaking because my hair was still cute you know it's still like the little wet look or whatever and so me and king are setting up the cameras and stuff in the house and um like we couldn't figure out we set up the cameras and stuff trying to get like all the best angles yes. your food in there yeah trying to make sure you know real how it is okay, yeah. you know you can't do it without that that's what i'm saying so then y'all um we trying to set the angles up and stuff like that right and then we don't know where my girl she'll be like um why she not text me back not why she not responding you know all of this and that and so as i'm sitting there not responding not like she facetimed me like six times i didn't answer she texted me like eight times i didn't answer and um i knew that was gonna like make her mad or whatever so i knew she was gonna be like why you ain't answer the phone like why you ain't texting me did it up so she come in the door and it was up from there like up from there and we went through hell trying to hurry up and get this last shit, like this last little moment in because the hookah coal fell on the table and it almost burnt king and it almost burned my carpet and i just got the carpet so i would have been mad as hell but it was just a lot we had to go through to get this video but i hope you guys like it because it was super cool and king's a very like chill laid back individual like he was cool and stuff like that i'm really glad that him and my girlfriend got along as well as they did because yeah i guess somebody got into a car accident or something because it's glass all over the ground well it don't mean somebody got into a car accident but it looked like window glass so i don't know but it could have been like a what color bottle i don't know probably like a sprite glass bottle 
Oh yeah, that could be somebody throwing it outside. Yeah, somebody could have thrown it and it shot it all over the ground. But it was real cool. I'm glad they got along. Well, we all got along, and it was very cool talking to him because. You know, he let us know information and stuff like that. Like, he gave us tips and stuff on, you know, just, you know, growing as people and growing as YouTubers and stuff like that. That was very cool, very chill. Um, yeah, guys. So, I really hope y'all really like that video because, look, we put a lot of editing and a lot of thought and a lot of hours in for that video so i really hope y'all enjoy it and um make sure y'all like comment and subscribe make sure y'all like that video up comment on that video um and yeah guys we're gonna talk to you later because we finna go eat so